hi everyone and a welcome to my channel so today i have for you a dirt cheap haul i made five trips to the dirt cheap over the course of about i don't know six weeks or so and i didn't find too many things at any one trip so i've been saving the items and now i have enough stuff to make a haul video so this is what what i got Retail value for the things that I'm fixing to show you was $625.35, but I paid $152.37 for a savings of $472.98. On average, I saved 76% off. So a lot of this stuff was 80, some of it was 90, a few items were 50, but overall about 76%. So um, this, First off, this basket is one of those, they call them the pop-up kind. Um, this was originally $20. It is by the brand Opal House. It was originally 20 bucks. I got it for 10. So this is one of the items that was 50% off, but I want it to put on top of my craft shelves, like to fill it up with yarn or to fill it up with ribbon or something big that needs a bigger container. So that's what I got that far. That's what I got that for. Next, I got a couple of things for my granddaughter. First, I picked her up this cute little skirt. Um, it is by the brand Justice. Um, I paid $6 for it. It has the um, built-in skirt, which is, uh, you know, awesome. It's like the little like spandex biker shorts. So she can wear this with the little t-shirt and her Vans and look just super cute. Um, they do have this still on their website, but I don't think it is this wash and it was like $26.95. I went and looked it up just now and I picked it up for $6. So that was a really good find. Next, I got her a pair of Justice jeans. Um, these were also $6 and on average, the Justice jeans run about $29.95. Um, so I got these, these are mid rise, slim, soft and stretchy. So, um, here they are, they're dark wash and they do have some distressing on them and they are the skinny legs. She looks really cute in the, uh, ballerina style. Um, Old Navy has a ballerina style um, jean that is just super cute on her. But anything that is like like the, the skinny leg looks really good on her. Um, you know, we all have our own preferred style of jean. Um, I like the low rise. They fit my body better. Some people like high rise. But um, the ballerina leg fits my granddaughter really good. So I was super excited to get these in for six bucks and they're brand new. About the only way you can get a pair of jeans for six bucks is, you know, the thrift store. So to get them for brand new and their name brand Justice, that's a really good deal. Next, so I do have a Disney room. It is a hot mess right now, but it is decked out in Disney, all things Disney in there. And, um, so I picked this one up. I've never watched this movie. Um, I'm not even sure how to say her name correctly, but I picked her up. She was originally $10.99. I got her for $2.50 and she's a Funko Pop. So when uh, my youngest daughter was home over Christmas last year, um, she bought me some Funko Pops for that room. And so I thought I would add this to the collection. So the ones she bought me have never been opened, but this one I will open. Um, in fact, we can open it right now um, because the, the box is messed up. So And she's real cute. There she is. Just pretty A little thing to collect. So got that. Next, I picked up some... These were from the Target uh, Dollar Spot, and they are just this paper. It's just called Paper Roll. 
They were $3 on the dollar spot and they had them 80% off. So I picked up these two prints for 60 cents each. So you can just roll these out if you're gonna do like a picnic theme or I, I bought this one thing and I could use it for, for fall if I wanted to, like, you know, down the middle of the table. So I got those, they're just good to have. Um, cheap little things to decorate with next i picked up this metal sign um it was originally 14.99 but they had it on sale for 75 cents had i known they were on sale for 75 cents i would have got a couple of them to share um but i didn't know they wouldn't ring up so that's the thing with dirt cheap not all their tags if their tag is like messed up in any kind of way, it won't scan. So this one wouldn't scan. So when I took it up there, the lady said, oh, it's 75 cents. So anyway, I didn't get, they had a crap ton of them too. I like it though, cause it's the gray and the black and the white, like my kitchen. Just says support your local butcher. Butcher, baker, barbecue maker. So I got that. Next, I got another really cool deal. Um, for everyone that is familiar with Hearth and Hand, um, with Magnolia, that is Chip and Joanne Gaines, I picked up this a really nice um, table runner. It was originally $24.99. It says um, it's, it's a standard runner, table runner for a layered look. So I did pick up four of these. Um, I know I'm going to uh, give one to my sister for her table. And I'm not sure what I'll do with the rest of them, but I picked them up. There was a crap ton of them. So, I was glad to have found it. So, here it is. Let's see if we can get this off. Let me just, let me cut it instead of struggle with it. There we go. So it's really large. That's just half. So it's probably maybe two. I don't even know how long it is. Let's see if it tells us the dimensions. Hope everyone is having a great day. It is 20 inches by 90 inches. So, oh, they give us a picture of what it looks like. There you go. So that is really cool and to get it for a dollar 25 i would have never paid 24.99 for this in the store and no 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 so anyway i got several of those next i picked up some of these boot shape shapers it's a pair of cheetah ones you blow them up and you put them in your boots so your boots don't crease they were $7.99, I got them for 80 cents. So I picked up two sets. Um, I also picked up two sets of these. These are for your tablet speaker. I guess it just directs the sound coming out of your phone or tablet. Um, so $7.99 for 80 cents. So we'll give those a try. Hopefully it'll work on my with my cell phone. If it doesn't, well, I haven't lost much, but I just wanted to give those a try. Those were each $7.99, 80 cents each, and I picked up two of each. Next are some little knobs that I picked up. Anytime I find clearance drawer knobs, I'll pick them up if they're cute or if they're nice. So picked up these. These were originally $3.58. They had them on clearance for a dollar seven. There's the price and Here's what they look like. So, I was excited to get those. I picked up five of them. So, got those. Next is a mistake on my part. So, I need, I, I don't need, I wanted a new bed, a new bed skirt, a white bed skirt. I have one, but I, I wanted it bigger. I wanted it in a king size bed so it could go around all four sides. Right now, it's like, it's too hard to explain. My bed is long ways instead of this way. Like how you sleep going this way, it's this way on the wall. So, so one side is pushed up against the wall. So, the, the long side's showing and the short side's 
So I have a queen size com a queen size bed skirt on it. So one end doesn't have a skirt on it. So if I got a king size, I would be able to come all the way around. So what I thought I had was a king size and I did originally have a king size, but it was a little dirty and I found this one. So I so, said, oh, I'll just get to this one. When I got home, I realized I didn't have a king size. I had a full size. So I was kind of upset about that. Uh, it was $27.99, paid $5.60 for it. So that was kind of a waste of $5.60. But I will keep this and you just never know, you know, when it might come in handy. And if it doesn't ever come in handy, well, I can just donate. And I'm sure somebody would love to have that. So anyway, that was a long story. <laughs> and I still don't know if I made myself understandable. Anyway. All right. So next are some dinosaur balloon kits. They were $3 originally for $15 cents so i bought several of these and i bought several of these these just look like fun to do with the kids um with the the great nephew i i don't know i just thought they would be fun to do you just make the little balloon so anyway something random next is a heated blanket um, I'm probably like everyone else. We try to go probably as long as we can without turning the heater on during the winter time. Um, so I got myself a heated blanket. It was $69.99 and they had it on sale for $14. So I got that. I had actually had another one and something just told me to go back to the back and open it up and uh, check it out and so I did and it didn't even have controllers in it so at dirt cheap they do have a table in the back of each store or somewhere in each store a table set up where you can plug stuff in test it out because once you buy it it's yours you can't take it back and uh, so if I had left out of there with that blasted blanket with no controllers I would have just been stuck with it and they are cheaper but $14 would be, you know, quite a bit to just waste. And uh, so, uh, I, this one does have controllers in it, and it seemed to work. So, got that. And then last but not least is I got some curtain rods. So, I have this one style of curtain rods that I've been picking up. The first set of curtain rods, which is in my living room, I picked up at Target and paid full price for them. It's a long rod. It was like $45 or something, some. But then we started seeing them at dirt cheap. So um, I've been picking them up for all my rooms. But this room I'm in doesn't have them. Um, the craft room, two windows still need them. The Disney room doesn't have them. And I don't think, I don't know if my bedroom has them. Anyway, so I've just been picking them up as I go when I see them so that I can change out all my curtain rods. So here's what they look like. They are this like industrial, heavy duty curtain rod. They're really nice. They come in different finishes. The finish really doesn't matter to me because it's going to be covered up with the curtain anyway. Um, so this one was $28 so I got it for $5.60 but other ones the prices are kind of all over the map um, I picked up one of these curtain rods okay so I got four of these I'm not going to show you all of them they're all just about the same they're different sizes one of them was $28 but I got it 50% off so I got it for $14 one of them was $43 but it was half off, so I got it for $21.50. One of them was a short one, and it was $9.99. I got it for $5.99. And then this one was $28, and I got it for $5.60. So you, you just never know. I figure even like the, the one that was $21.50 is the really big one. Um, it could cover 
three three windows i think it's it's really the it's really the really big one um with the extension in the middle and all that the 991 is a short one which could probably fit like this window that's behind me just a single uh window but anyway the prices are all over the place i just pick them up if they seem like they're a good price i pick them up and then last but not least is um i picked up a curtain rod for my daughter's home so her home has got a um big sliding glass door and it is super hot coming through that window and it would just like the ac cannot even keep up with that in the in the afternoons holy cannoli it, it gets hot so i bought her this one and it was $29.69 but i got it for five dollars and 94 cents so there's that so i think two weekends ago i went over to her house I had for this window behind me at Walmart, I had bought just the old school white plain curtain rod. And she's like, Mom, like my my house is so hot and ugh, all the things. So I said, Well, that's okay. I'll come. I got curtains that, that were in the living room before I changed over to my white ones. I'll bring those and I have the curtain rod, which is the one I was gonna use back here. So I go over there, I get everything, get the level and all the things. Um you know measured out and hung up and we go to put that it was an insulated curtain so those are kind of heavy and it was two pounds that little curtain rod said Rah! it just like crumbled i'm like holy crap grab it before it all yanks out of the wall and you know all the things so get it back up there get the middle bracket put i'm like don't go out this door until i can get y'all a real a real curtain rod so i got her a real curtain rod and over the weekend i will go over there and we will get this hung and they will be set to go in fact if i got her this curtain rod i'll probably um get her another panel because i think i had six insulated panels for that big window in the living room so i can probably get her another one that way it'll be even um more like spread out so another long story guys but i was super excited to get this and for six bucks and this is like heavy duty is by the brand threshold so i know this is a good one anyway guys that is it let me look around that's it that's my haul i was super i'm super excited with all the things i got so many great items um i don't know what i did with my paper it's probably on the ground behind me who knows I don't know but dang it okay I have the scrap paper I was adding on so 152 37 that is a really good price I was su I'm, I'm super excited with everything so I hope everyone has a great day a great um, a weekend I'm not sure what day this will come out but we are heading into the weekend and I get to spend a little bit of time with my family and go celebrate my dad. Um, it was his heavenly birthday just a few days ago. And we always go to the cemetery and just spend a little bit of family time out there and um, eat lunch and just hang out for a little bit as a family and um, celebrate him. So we will be doing that over the weekend and um, I'm looking forward to it. So hope y'all have a great day. If you've enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button. Become part of my friends here on YouTube. And y'all take care. See you in my next video. Bye, guys.